Hi guys! A couple of you have told me that the words that I gave you in my previous video sounded too much alike and it was hard for you to memorize them. So I thought this is a good time for us to discuss easy ways to learn new words when you study foreign language. I've studied several foreign languages myself and also I've been teaching foreign languages for 20 years now. So I'm going to share what has worked for me and my students. So let's say I speak English, I don't know Russian, I need to memorize that list. So what I would do, which I always did, I looked at the list and picked the easy words to remember. So it helped me to start adding words to my vocabulary, it also built my confidence and helped me to keep going. It was easy to build on it, so that's what I would do. Uh, so if I looked at that particular list from my previous video on the names for different parts of the day, I would notice that the Russian word for day, din, sounds pretty much the same, doesn't it? Day, din. And then the word for night is not the same, but very similar. Night, noch. Night, noch. So I would learn those two words first, and then I could build on that and add midnight and noon. Because just like I told you in that previous video, in Russian we also use two roots for those words. So in English, noon is also midday and uh, midnight. So mid, middle, the middle of the day, the middle of the night, two roots. In Russian we also use two roots. We use the word for half, polavina. So we take the root of that word, pol, instead of mid, we have pol. And then after that you follow with day or night. So for noon, pol din, the stress is on the first syllable. And for midnight, pol nech. So you see once I got day and night down, now I'm adding half of the day and half of the night. So that gives me four words, pol din, pol nech. Now I have only two words left. So what I would do, I would look at the words and see what can I use to help me memorize the words? What can I use to help my brain? So does it remind me of anything? Maybe other words in any language that I know, any associations that come to my mind. The crazier the association, the better, because our minds like to remember absurd things easy. So when I look at the morning, at the Russian word for morning, I would probably think of ooh, the first sound, and that reminds me of people not liking getting up in the morning to go to work. So maybe they would say something like, oh, I have to get up. <laughs> and then the second part of the word era, that kind of reminds me of an angry dog, growling dog. So the dog is also unhappy that <laughs> he or she needs to get up in the morning, also wants to sleep more. The person is unhappy, the dog is unhappy. So that's the image, that's the picture that my mind would create for that word. And if I remembered ooh, if I anchored that for morning, then that would help me to recreate the rest of the word. There is te, obviously, utra. So utra, morning, that's how I would probably deal with that word. And then there would be only one word left. So vecher is evening. And maybe we should ask you uh, how you memorize this word, what technique you used, if you already know this word well. And also if you used any other tools for this particular list uh, and any kind of life hacks that you discovered, something that uh, you always apply when you have to memorize a list of new words in a foreign language. So I would be very, very curious to know what has helped you, what have you discovered that works for you. And if you could share in the comments with our community, I'm sure that everyone would be very grateful to see. Uh, the tools that you've been using. So that's it for now and let me know in the comments how it goes and happy studying! Пока-пока!